For generations humanity has gazed into the heavens seeking answers, formulating theories, crafting equations, and envisioning our role in the vast cosmic puzzle. But now, everything we thought we knew, our physics, our cosmology, our understanding of space and time, has been shaken at its foundations. The James Webb Space Telescope has captured something that defies every expectation. Galaxies that are impossibly old, planets far too massive, structures eerily perfect, and a signal, steady, rhythmic, and unmistakably unnatural. None of it fits into any known astrophysical framework. This isn't just another scientific discovery, it's a confrontation between belief and reality. What JWS has revealed may be the most startling cosmic warning or invitation in human history. And if it's true, then our understanding of the universe may be completely wrong. Through a series of deep field observations, JWST delivered the sharpest views of the cosmos we've ever seen. But beauty wasn't the only thing hiding in the data. In galaxy cluster AEL 2744, scientists noticed precisely aligned light sources and symmetrical formations that have no place in the disorderly process of galactic formation. In spiral galaxy NGC 1365, strange motion patterns hinted at gravitational forces that directly oppose our current models, and it didn't stop there. These bizarre anomalies showed up again and again in image after image. The deeper web peered into space, the stranger and more inexplicable the universe became. Patterns, identical and deliberate, spanning billions of light years. Are we witnessing evidence of a design, a message, or simply confronting the limits of our understanding? Structures with geometric precision, appearing in a universe long thought to be ruled by chaos. At first, scientists dismissed them as coincidences, but the patterns were too consistent, too frequent, too flawless. Gradually, the quiet doubt grew louder. What if this isn't randomness at all? What if it's a higher order we simply haven't yet begun to understand? Among the James Webb Space Telescope's many targets was the exoplanet HIP, 65,426 b, hundreds of light years from Earth. What it revealed stunned astronomers. This planet is seven times more massive than Jupiter, orbits its star at a distance three times farther than Neptune, and does so around a star that is only 15 million years old, a cosmic infant. According to every established theory of planetary formation, HIP 65426b shouldn't exist. There's no visible protoplanetary disk, no debris cloud, and no known gravitational mechanics to explain how such a massive planet could form so far from its star so quickly and remain in a stable orbit. Some researchers have begun to wonder, what if this planet didn't form here at all? Could it be a relic? Something left over from an earlier cycle of cosmic history? transplanted, reused, or even placed? The questions deepen with each observation. In one of the most astonishing findings to date, James Webb captured a breathtaking image of an Einstein ring, created when a massive galaxy bends the light from another more distant galaxy behind it. These rings are rare, but the one found around galaxy J418 is something else entirely nearly perfect. A flawless, continuous circle of light. Its symmetry is so mathematically precise that even seasoned astrophysicists were at a loss. For such an image to exist, the alignment between the two galaxies must be exact, within fractions of a degree, across billions of light years. It challenges probability, and perhaps the very nature of what we believe the cosmos to be. This isn't just rare, it's statistically improbable on a cosmic scale. While gravitational lensing is a well-understood phenomenon, the level of precision seen in this case is raising more questions than answers. Could it point to a deeper symmetry woven into the very fabric of space-time? Yet no discovery has shaken the scientific community more than this. The James Webb Space Telescope has detected massive mature galaxies forming just 180 million years after the Big Bang. That might sound distant, but in cosmic terms, it's virtually impossible. According to our current models, 
galaxies shouldn't have had enough time to grow to these enormous sizes, organize into spiral structures, or emit the kind of brightness Webb has recorded. These galaxies are as large and structured as the Milky Way, fully formed and stable, at a time when the universe should have still been a turbulent cloud of gas. The discovery has thrown cosmologists into a state of re-evaluation. Because if the data is correct and these galaxies truly are that ancient, then our entire framework for how the universe began is in jeopardy. The Big Bang, once considered the unshakable foundation of modern cosmology, may no longer hold. And now some scientists are openly entertaining a once unthinkable idea that the universe may have had a history before what we've called the beginning. In one of the most baffling findings yet, Webb detected a gravitational lensing effect in a completely empty patch of space. No visible stars, no galaxies, not even a black hole. Whatever is bending light there remains invisible, raising profound questions about what's truly out there and what else we might be missing. And yet, light from even more distant galaxies bends, twists, and warps as if pulled by something massive, something invisible. Astronomers have tentatively pointed to dark matter, the unseen substance thought to make up most of the universe's mass, as the cause. But in this case, the lensing effect is too strong, too focused. It doesn't behave like a diffuse halo of dark matter. Instead, it acts like a defined object, something with shape, edges, and symmetry. Could it be a dense cluster of dark matter compressed into a form we've never seen before? Or is this gravitational anomaly a relic, a remnant of something far older than we've imagined, left behind like a cosmic fossil? Some physicists are beginning to whisper more radical ideas, that what we're seeing isn't dark matter at all, but evidence of something constructed, an ancient, invisible structure still warping space with its silent presence. One of the James Webb Space Telescope's most controversial discoveries deepens the mystery. It has detected a vast intergalactic filament, a colossal thread of galaxies and matter stretching over a billion light years across. While scientists have observed such filaments as part of the so-called cosmic web, this one stands apart. Its alignment, density, and the precision of its repeating voids make it look eerily like a grid, almost as if a framework has been laid across the universe. Mainstream cosmology explains such patterns as the natural result of gravity acting over billions of years. But the symmetry here is difficult to ignore, and it's forcing some to wonder, are we seeing the architecture of something far more intentional? The galaxies move in parallel, their paths uncannily aligned, clumps of dark matter appear at precise intervals, spaced with mathematical regularity. Even the redshift measurements in this region follow a wave-like pattern, as if the very fabric of space here has been shaped by design. Some scientists remain skeptical, cautioning that the human brain is hardwired to detect patterns, even where none truly exist. But others are beginning to ask a more provocative question. If the universe were shaped by intelligence, or if it once had a builder, wouldn't this be where we might start to see the fingerprints? In trying to explain these gravitational anomalies, one theory has slowly moved from the fringes of speculation into the realm of serious discussion. What if dark matter, long thought to be inert and invisible, actually carries information? Not data in the digital sense, but something more primal, a kind of cosmic memory. Across multiple James Webb observations, scientists have noticed galaxy clusters forming in arrangements that seem to echo older structures observed in distant parts of the universe. These patterns aren't identical, but they are suspiciously familiar, like ripples repeating through time and space. What if dark matter isn't random at all? What if it retains imprints of ancient cosmic events and guides the formation of new galaxies based on those long-forgotten alignments? It's an idea that blurs the boundary between science and philosophy, suggesting that the universe may not only have a beginning, but a memory. If that's true, then every spiral galaxy, every massive cluster, every yawning void might be part of an ancient pattern, a blueprint etched into the cosmos itself. 
but perhaps the most unsettling discovery of all is the one almost no one wants to talk about. During a deep field scan of an otherwise empty sector, the James Webb Space Telescope detected a series of pulses, faint fluctuations of light, too regular to be random yet too weak to come from any known star. The signals didn't match the profiles of pulsars or quasars, they repeated at exact intervals then fell silent. At first the team suspected an error, perhaps a reflection, interference or a data processing glitch, but when the signal was run through multiple independent systems, the pattern persisted. The source showed no stellar mass, no nebula, no thermal signature, just a precise flash, consistent and measured, originating from what appears to be... nothing. For now, NASA has declined public comment. But behind closed doors, scientists are whispering a question that has haunted cosmology for decades. What if this isn't a message meant to be understood, only noticed? And if so, who or what was meant to notice it? The James Webb Telescope was designed to peer deep into the past, to reveal the birth of stars and galaxies, to unravel the timeline of the cosmos, but in doing so, it may have uncovered something even more profound. A glimpse into a universe that's not just vast, but intentional. Galaxies forming too soon, planets that defy gravitational models, pulses with no source, structures with geometric symmetry, these aren't random anomalies. This isn't just science fiction brushing against possibility. This is something else. and it's beginning to look back. These aren't theories, they're data points, real, measurable, and impossible to ignore, that challenge the very foundations of our understanding. And if the patterns are genuine, if the pulses are deliberate, if the universe remembers, then we must face the most unsettling possibility of all. We have never been alone, not in space, not in time, not even in thought, because what the James Webb Space Telescope may have uncovered isn't just a snapshot of the early universe. It could be a message, a system waiting, quietly, for us to look closely enough, and now that we have... We may never look at the stars the same way again. So now the question passes to you, are these discoveries signs of something greater? Or are they reflections, echoes of our own longing to find meaning in the silence? Let us know what you believe in the comments. And if you're drawn to these cosmic riddles, to the questions most are still too afraid to ask, be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications, because you know the next image from James Webb might not just show us where we came from, It might show us where we're meant to go. We'll see you beyond the